turtle is me with a tutorial and I'm gonna show you how to make like a professional watermark cause that way nobody can steal your shit so yeah and right now I gotta fix this all my stuff got messed up somehow and it's and I gotta line it up and if you hear stuff in the background it's cause my cousin's downstairs being all loud so yeah <laughs> need to exit off all this stuff cause I forgot to and I'm not even in my pictures this is starting off great so right now I'm going through my pictures <coughs> sorry for that now just find a picture you want I recommend a picture like this it doesn't have to be that color the color doesn't matter you can change the color later just a big solid image or just something like that you don't want anything with a bunch of stuff in it because it won't really show that well and I recommend kind of a bulky text not like like calligraphy or script or anything like that so just I'm using text I don't know what text it is and just type in the color doesn't matter you're not gonna be using the text the original text layer anyway so right now I'm just gonna type in watermark so okay make it bigger you can make it whatever size you want try to line it up with the image you can just move it stretch it out some make it a little bit smaller and I'm just gonna apply that I forgot to unlock the original layer in the back and now get out your hold on what the hell am I doing I was trying to create a layer mask but I just didn't do it right but yeah so hold on blah 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 just trying to do it again don't really know so but then basically you go get the quick selection tool and then get it all selected and on the on your background layer click delete and then just if you like using anything with a space in the middle like an O or a P an A R R it's just gonna show up you know and just click like on the R in the little dot like click it make sure you select it not the whole letter and just go back to the original layer and delete it like that's what I'm having to do right now it's not gonna be perfect every time alright now just delete the text layer because you don't need it anymore yes delete and now you have your watermark and that's just add like a stroke whatever you want and bevel and boss if you want it I kinda wanted a watery look so I'm gonna add an outer or inner glow and put it blue that way the blue kinda fades in so I'm, I mean you just do whatever you want this is basically what I wanted but you got the basic info now and just making this <laughs> and you put your name <coughs> sorry guys I got kind of a cough but just put whatever you want on it like I said you can make it any color but whenever you do make the blending option on your color color <laughs> like if you want it green put it as that over there where there's a red and then make the blending option color like I was scrolling through but I want to keep mine at the original layer color because I like that and now I'm going to show y'all basically what a watermark is for I'm just going to take an old background I made for somebody just a random one okay and this is a background I made for fiction and just basically just apply the watermark on there so nobody sells you shit like if you make someone a background and they're trying to say it's your say that they made it yourself just throw in your username on it and what the fuck are they gonna do as they try to get it out they're probably gonna mess up the background alrighty this has been the first tutorial by turtles me comment rate and subscribe and tell me what you like constructive criticism whatever